So having a purpose is what's your guiding light or your beacon to where you want to get to. When it's cold, like it is this morning here in Brisbane, there's not many people out and about. For those of us that are out and about, are driven to succeed in one way or another for our own purposes. It's all too easy if you haven't got a strong purpose, a, a strong desire to stay in bed when it's cold. I don't blame you. Some days I wish I'd rather be in bed as opposed to getting up at four o'clock. But I got up at four, I worked hard for the first two and a half hours of my day. Now it's time for a bit of exercise. Uh, so I've had the mental exercise for the morning, now it's time for a bit of physical exercise. Uh, and then get on with the day. But I'm very clear on my why. Why am I doing this? And it's so, so important that as you start your journey out, understand your why. Because you're going to have times where you have ups and downs. It's going to be tough. You're going to have be disappointed. <laughs> Things aren't going to go as you thought they would. That's called life. But it's during those tough times that your purpose is what's going to pull you through. Your why for doing all this is going to pull you through. So really get quite deep with your why. Feel it. Feel why it is that you're doing what you're doing. Visualize it, what it feels like when you achieve your goals. And by understanding your purpose and then visualizing what you want your life to be like, I guarantee you that you go a long way to pulling yourself out of bed on these cold mornings, to taking yourself to places that are right out of your comfort zone. But you're doing it because you've got a longer term goal, a longer term vision in mind.